Greetings from the BSC Designer team. In the previous tutorial, we discussed how to do the initial setup of an account. Now, it's time to invite members of your strategy team to join BSC Designer. Let's switch to the Users section. Here, you have the control panel for all users registered under your account. If you work with a small strategy team, you can add users one by one by clicking on the Add User button. To add many users at once, send an invite link to the members of your team so that they can do self-registration. Let's click on the Edit button next to the user. Here, the account administrator can decide about the type of user. You can have View Only Users, Data Input Users, who can update existing KPIs with new data, and Power Users, the key strategist of your team who can add new goals, KPIs, initiatives, input data, and more. Depending on the type of user, the software will suggest some additional settings. For example, for data input users, an administrator can decide if approval is required for the entered data or if this user can modify historical data. In the next steps, we'll give users access rights to the scorecards and assign them as owners for the business goals and initiatives. We can do it user by user, or we can assign users to a team and start working with team of users. Let's switch to the My Scorecards section. That's your strategy workspace where the scorecards can be organized into some structure and aligned with each other. Use the Share button to give a team or a user access to all scorecards, certain groups, or selected scorecards. Now, let's open a scorecard. How do we know who is responsible for a business goal or an initiative? In the software, we use the Owner property for this. Owners can be assigned to a specific goal, indicator, or initiative. Owners can be displayed on the KPIs tab and in the reports. Owners will receive important notifications about the changes related to their indicators, goals, or initiatives. The administrator of an account can configure notifications for the owners in the settings on the Workflow tab. Among stakeholders of strategic plannings, there are also senior strategists. Similar to the strategy team, senior strategists need to have access to the scorecards. In addition, they might be interested in seeing the overall picture and getting regular performance reports. In the My Scorecards section, all scorecards have some performance data. This number corresponds to the total performance of this scorecard. That's a good way to see how different business units are performing in general. As for performance reporting, in any scorecard, there is a report command that gives you access to some predefined report profiles and a possibility to create your own reports via the Customize option. You can use the Schedule button to send these reports regularly to your strategy team. We discussed how to onboard your strategy team in BSC Designer. In the next onboarding tutorials, we'll talk about migrating an existing strategy to BSC Designer and using BSC Designer for strategy meetings.